Okay, I'm in the lobby of the Milan. All right, let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Can you hear yourself? <laughs> I think someone else is hacking in. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Shit. It's scanning the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Damien, it's over. I'm disconnected. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Not a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. Gave the order. Come on, man. I don't. I don't know. You don't know. Hit the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. So what do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name. Yeah, and I'll tell you a name. Go. any kids, all right? That wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys. I heard stories, man, that like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Some things you can't walk please! away from. Please! Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to him on the phone and he told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know. A name. Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me. Ah! How's your memory now? Ah.
Shaking, motherfucker. Shit! Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. Ah! Ah! I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill him otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> huh. Nice shot. Huh. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah. True story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pop, 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 pop. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. You'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. I handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. Why here, of all places? Looks like a game. Uh. Rogers opposed now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base steals on this team with 27 steals this like year. Looks like it unlocks from the other side. Like that's a pitch and a hit, and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Roger's not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna give soon, and it could go either way. Sonoma pitches. That's a big hit! See anything? Nope. Quiet here. We've got a known vice boy in the VIP lounge. We're gonna check him out. Okay, I'm coming up. He's not moving unless I give him a reason. Thank you. 
take the bait. I ain't doing this shit. Hey, you, sir. This is yeah, you, bullshit, come here. man. You ain't got no probable cause. We're just talking. Hey, man, look, I got my tickets right no, here. No, keep your hands where I can hey, see them. this is bullshit. Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're vice wars, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. How did you two afford VIP ticket? Mm, bet she makes more than you do. Yeah? Hey, yo, what? D... Bad boy. Police are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. Through the whole stadium, I thought he wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with a serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. With all these cops, there's gotta be one around. Evacuation plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. But you got an isolated incident in the basement, we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. Damn That's gonna boy. cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. Oh, shut it down, eh? Where are you, Jordy? What? Gone. I'm allergic to cops. So is my race. But don't worry, I left you a present. Friend of a friend deals in pre-owned cars. Got a real beauty waiting for you in the garage across the street. Tell you to leave it, I don't care. Gotta go. I just saw a bunch of cops fly by out there. That's a lot of sirens for a blackout. Shit, something ain't right. We should stay put. What's going on? Come on,
like nothing I've ever seen before. You better walk away from this, man! Why are you sitting here? He's coming, right? Not like last time. Jackson, I did invite him. It's been so long. Are you sure you called the right number? Honey, your uncle's a different kind of person. It doesn't mean he doesn't love us. Finding Maurice was correct. We've gained access to the CTUS back door while the police were being distracted by you. Since we both win in this, we'll share what we have. That back door allows you some access to the CTUS network. I'm still working on something bigger. Give me time.
<laughs> okay, you're the boss. We'll go to plenty. Sick of remembering her that way. It's never a dream of her tiny face pressing the window when she knows I was coming over. Or that little wobbly dance she did. It's always the same nightmare. things. Lucky for me, this city's full of distractions. And they can't hide from me. I'll have to thank CTOS one day. Simple breach of their facial recognition software, and I've got access to everyone's personal details. of his call and he's mine. somewhere. Just move carefully. Don't get spotted. Let the profiler do the work. All right. He's close. She must be the woman he's after. <laughs> this guy's close. I can feel it. We need to talk. There is nothing to talk about. We're done. Deal with You're it. You're so fucking wrong. I'm not done yet. Get I gotta away. stop him now. I'll scream. I'll teach you.
changed is real. And it's here in Chicago. Can you hurry? Get your maps here. Uh, would you like one? Keep moving, D. How about you? Who's hungry? I know. Nikki, hey, I know, I know. The party started. It's almost over. Where are you? I'm on my way. Ugh, you make me crazy. Jackson's really looking forward to it. Get over here. We miss you. I miss you too. I'll be there. Sorry, Nick. I need to take this. I'll, I'll see you soon. Good. You got out. Look, if you need some wheels, give me a call. I'll, I'll set you up. Pre-owned cars? You'd rather register yourself at a car dealer? I don't ask questions. This guy gets me any ride I want. And you, if you need it. I just might. How's Maurice doing? Oh, he's all sunshine and buttercups. I'm gonna dump him at my little dumping place. I need him alive, Jordy. Yeah, yeah, alive. Whatever. Goes against your better nature, huh? Well, I'd pop him and be done, but hey, you pay me right, I'll keep him alive as long as you want. I do work for a paycheck. Lucky Quinn.
so you're leaving, just like that. Not keep moving. You think you can talk to me like that? Oh, Holy! Oh, no, please! Dead set. I haven't been in Nikki since the funeral. Am I ready? Jack's last birthday, Lena sang off key. Happy birthday. Full throttle, no holds barred. Now, I'm afraid of the silence. In that case, uh, you deserve ten birthday tickles. What? One, two, three, four, Whoa. five, six, Stop. seven, Whoa. eight, nine, ten. <laughs> ten. 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 Stay here for a second. So, an entire year and... and... Yeah, late. Yeah, I'm sorry, Nate. Really. Let's have a look at you. You look older. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> it's his first birthday without Lena. Uh, how's he doing? Still doesn't talk to anybody but me. Yolanda says it's his way of maintaining some sort of control. Yolanda? His therapist. She's helping him. It's good. Just slow. It's hard, but we're gonna get through it. Mm -hmm. 
Jax. Hey. S sorry I'm late. Can I, uh, can I get a hug? Wow. You are big. <laughs> so, hey, what, what do you got there? Wow, the healer. Cool. You bought him a real toy, huh? <laughs> Why don't you bring up your toys? I'm gonna speak with your uncle. Yeah, I'll be I'll be up there in a sec. This matters. You being here. I just need to make sure that things are different. Things are different. You and Jax are the most important people in my life. I'm not gonna stop watching out for you. <laughs> Always the big brother, huh? Last time I was back here, it was Lena's birthday. Jackson adored her. We all did. You missed all the fun. The kids were playing vigilante, imitating that guy they keep talking about on TV. Let me guess. Jax was the vigilante. No, they were all the vigilantes, and I was the only villain, but I make a mean bad guy. <laughs> I gave him hell. I should have come earlier. I could have warned them. Don't mess with my sister. Remember when you and Mom were both sick as dogs, but Dad insisted his boy was gonna have his birthday cake? That thing was an abomination, all burnt and lopsided. That was Dad in a nutshell. He did a lot of ugly things, but it was always about family. <laughs> Listen to me, I'm rambling. Oh, really? No, 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 don't let me interrupt you. Who is this? You think blogging caller ID will hide you? I don't know what's so entertaining, but the police won't find it very funny at all. I'm gonna give you some advice. Are you listening? Go outside, meet people, get a life, and stop calling me. What did you say? Listen, the police can trace this call. I know where you live. How are the locks on those doors? Who is this? Why are you calling? Do you feel safe, Nikki? Who was that? Doesn't matter, just some stupid crank, it happens. Do you think this is strong enough? Look, did you know his voice? Oh, Jesus, Aiden, just leave it, it's fine. It's fine, he thinks he can get inside. How do you know what he thinks? You're checking the locks. Look, I can handle this on my own, we do not need your help. Nikki? I can find this guy. Okay, look, Aiden, God, you have not changed at all. We do not need your help. Please stop trying to fix our problems. Every time you try, you just make things worse. I better go. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Grown man making crank calls. Let's see how safe you feel when I trace your call. There you are. Damn it. He's on the move.
Yeah? I'm sorry. I overreacted. You just make me so crazy sometimes. Uh-huh. Come on back, okay? I promise I won't freak out on you. Uh... Aiden? <laughs> You're going after that creep, aren't you? Well... You're doing it right now. I can't believe you. It's not like that. Stop being a hero, Aiden. Let it go. Let what? Yeah, the call's breaking up. I can't hear you. No, you can hear me perfectly. You need to stop right now. Yeah, hello? You still there? Can't hear you. Okay, gotta go. Oh! that much just to make a crank call. Nikki Pierce, right? I'll mention the locks like you said. And her kid. I, I, this feels wrong. That's the point. Someone paid this asshole to harass Nikki. Who would pay for something like that? Did you get anyone with dead set? I need those CTOS hacks. Yeah, I'm still trying. They're kicking you out. Give me time. Okay. Well, I need your help then. Can you trace a phone call? How can I refuse my best client? Wait. What am I looking at here? It's from a guy who threatened my family. I want to know who hired him. Well, the call came from somewhere in the Loop District. But that's as far as I can see. Okay. I can hack CTOS inside the Loop. Then I should be able to pinpoint the source of that call. Let's do that. Bloom's building a new CTOS center in the loop. It's perfect. DeadSec tried to attack that center last month. We failed, and they just added more armed guards. So it won't be easy. Be careful. You sound like my sister. Relax. Make sure I'm armed and dangerous. private contractors to guard their CTOS centers. These guys will be geared up and wired for action. But I'll be ready.
Contract's clear. I need to find and erase these guys before they can get away. One, one, please state the nature of your emergency. Please, help us! Some guy is shooting up the place!
Give it up! Pull over! 